when I was running my board meetings, it felt a little bit more just routine, more reporting out, and then not really walking away with that rich conversation. So, you know, at our next board meeting, we're going to employ this tactic as well. And then when board members leave, they're given assignments. You know, when you leave, could you help us with this? Could you do these five things? So the board now leaves with tasks, just like the management team leaves with tasks. And so you get a much more balanced view of the board working for the company right, putting value into the company than just the management team reporting to the board for approval or not. And so now the management team is learning from you as the board. The management team who day to day is so heads down gets to step up and hear about what's going on that might impact their business. And then after each of the board members kind of, you know, gives their analysis of the world, sort of, um, then they have the board respond to what they heard from the senior management and what particularly struck them that was interesting. And so it was this really rich conversation among the management team and the board about, you know, potential challenges to the business, uh, potential threats that nobody had been thinking about. And I found myself realizing that the conversation was at such a valuable strategic level 